Okay, a couple people haven't arrived yet for your online learning event, but you're ready to start your breakout rooms. You open all the rooms and your participant will disappear. And then, so the rooms have started and now someone arrives late. Let's see, but they're not in a breakout room. So I just take the person that's unassigned, assigned to room one, and then I've sent them over. So that is how you add someone that perhaps they've been in a room, their internet uh, kicked them out, and they have to log back into the meeting. That is how you send them into a room. I'm going to show you that one more time. Close all rooms. Wait for everyone to come back, and I'm going to show you this one more time. Okay, so we're opening up breakout rooms. They are going to be moving automatically. This time, let's give it about two minutes. They're both going to the same room. Open all rooms and participants will go automatically. So they're both in the room. Well, what happens when one of the people that were in the room left? and then they were able to log back into the room. So they have not been assigned and I just have to send them to the room that they were in before. Now a hot tip, when you have a number of people that you write down who's in what group, um, write down their phone number if that's applicable and they've called in as well as joined through online but write down who's in what group because if people are popping in and out you need to know which room to send them back to um, and if you're dealing with quite a number of people you won't necessarily automatically remember so definitely write them down when you have set up the groups either manually or even if you've done them automatically um, and just write them down quickly, especially if you're giving the breakout session more than a minute or two. Uh, that's a good thing to do. So that's a great tip. And that is how you add someone to a breakout room after the fact when they have either a attended the, uh, the online learning meeting or event late, or they've been having internet issues and they had to leave and come back again. And that's how you do it. And my name is Patricia Regeer with Regeer Educational Services. I welcome you to subscribe, like this video, share, comment what kind of videos would be helpful for, for you or what Zoom questions you have. I welcome you to check out the links below. There's some great resources and opportunities. And until next week, I hope you have a light bulb learning moment and that you're able to facilitate those for your participants. Thanks again.